so really quick i just wanted to chime in here and i just wanted to show you the sugar lace in both sides of it so this is the matte side this side was face down in the mat um it is very flex flexible um it does kind of rip it's hard it's so weird now those of you are probably like right sugar lace was like two or three years ago it is what it is this is literally my first time using it if there's any new bakers out there this is you know for you you can know what not to expect because like i said again this is my first time using it these are my first time thoughts and opinions of it i do like it now the hobby lobby brand the smell is a little off-putting it is a very chemical vanilla weird smell um i know it is vanilla flavored but the smell is not favorable <laughs> we'll just say that i don't like the smell of it um, I did not taste it. I do not want to taste it because the smell alone is very off-putting. Now, this is just the Hobby Lobby brand. I don't know if other brands smell like this, but this is just my observation. Now, I wanted to show you, I don't know how well you can see up close, all those air bubbles. So I ended up using this side, um, which is actually, um, the. of course, this is the back side where it's all nice and shiny and I ended up using this side because it was smooth but this is actually the back side because I did not like how all these bubbles and again this is my first time using it so I don't know how to get air bubbles out of it I did tack the mat down um, so if anybody who's out there who has used this stuff before has any tips or tricks Miss Kara I don't know if you've used this stuff before um, how do you get all these air bubbles out of that? So there is a lot of air bubbles. That is why I did not use this, but this is like with, for Christmas. This would be really great for bows on top of a gift cake. It's very bendable, but it's like hard. Like there is a material. I can't think of it right now that feels like this, but it's like kind of plasticky. Um, it's durable for the most part i'm actually i'm gonna break it probably but yeah see i'm breaking it i'm ripping it right there but for the most part it's very pliable this is like i said great for i had um made a bow earlier or like you can make like ribbon like ribbons like that i mean like i said there we go <laughs> but you can make a bow and like actually pleat it this is probably going to break it but and you can make like lace bows like that's really neat let me see what happens if i oh yeah see i cracked it right there but yeah this was just i made an extra piece just to see if i liked this lace but like i said i ended up using the shiny part this you'll see this later in the video but I ended up using the shiny part on the cupcake but like I said I just wanted to chime in and uh, just talk about this for a second onward with the video